The patient suffers from cervical radiculopathy manifested as pain from the axilla down to the fingers. The original radicular symptoms were alleviated with the previous shot in which we did a selective nerve root block. Say she's presenting with pain in the axilla in the ulnar distribution because her radiculopathy is from C8. So now we're doing axillary nerve block to get pain that emanates from the axilla down the hand. Here's the axillary artery with the nerve surrounding it. The radial nerve is deep and the ulnar nerve is posterior to the artery. It gives me a little pinch, right? Doing right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Injecting by the ulnar nerve. Anything going down your hand? No, it's going down my arm. In the spot of your pain? Mm -hmm. Good. So we're surrounding the ulnar nerve with local anesthetic, lateral to the axillary artery. I'm trying a distal approach. We're trying to avoid cervical epidural steroid injections due to the proximity to the spinal cord. So using ultrasound, I'm trying a less invasive means of treating her pain.